Welcome to the hottest movie review on the internet today, the A-List Review. I am your host, the Game Changer, Wes Troop. It's back in theaters with a live second screen experience and coming back to Blu-ray soon, so I figured I would revisit The Fathoms Below, my review of The Little Mermaid, coming up now. Under the sea, under the sea. Nobody beat us, fry us and eat. A young mermaid makes a deal with a sea witch in order to be with the human she's falling in love with. The problem? She doesn't have her voice and must get the prince to kiss her in time in order to get it back and to remain human. So what did I think of The Little Mermaid? I thought it's a classic animated Disney film. The animation here is fantastic and really kickstarted a great era for the genre. It's humorous and cute, but can get pretty dark and even a little bit scary for the real little ones. The great story based on the Hans Christian Andersen fairy tale is heartfelt and romantic. And while it may appeal to girls more, boys shouldn't rule it out altogether. The film also has some beloved characters and some of the best sidekicks around. The talented voice cast includes Jodie Benson as Ariel, the mermaid who wants more out of life. Pat Carroll as Ursula, the octopus villain who tricks Ariel into her evil plan. Samuel E. Wright as Sebastian, the crab who must keep his eye on Ariel. Kenneth Mars as Triton, Ariel's father and the king of the sea. Buddy Hackett as Scuttle, a seagull who's a real bird brain. Jason Marin as Flounder, Ariel's young fish friend. And Christopher Daniel Barnes as Eric, the prince Ariel loves. There are also some wonderful songs in the film, including Part of Your World, Under the Sea, and Kiss the Girl. If you or any of the young ones in your family have never seen it, make sure The Little Mermaid is on your must-watch list. I'm going to give it the rating of A-List Approved. It gets the A-List seal of approval. So if you want to check out The Little Mermaid for yourself, you can try out the second screen experience thingy and a theater near you. You can find it through Netflix and, of course, at a DVD or Blu-ray store near you. Until next time, don't miss one single A-list second. You can subscribe to me right here on YouTube. Check out some other videos. You can like me on Facebook. Follow me on the Twitter. And of course, you can buy my book, the A-List Review 2012 Movie Yearbook. Over 140 reviews, only $10. Contact me through Facebook or Twitter if you're interested. Until next time, Troop.